Good morning, good morning, good morning, everyone. Or should I say good afternoon, or maybe even good evening. Rabbit is back at it once again with a surprising twist. More Final Fantasy XIV. All right, let me explain myself. I promised everyone that tomorrow we'd be having some Splatoon. That, that was what was supposed to happen today. But, um, I... I just found out that, um, a certain collab was happening today, and it was ha and it was happening right here and right now. I thought it would happen in, like, in the afternoon or something, but that wasn't the case. It was happening right now. It was- I saw- I saw that there- that Final Fantasy XIV and XVI was having their collab right here at this time. So, I'm like, shoot, I need to do this right now. Because more likely I may not be able to touch it if I, if I, when I come back home. But, yeah. So, I really, really, really am sorry that we're not playing Splatoon today. But instead we're playing some Final, Fan Final Fantasy XIV. I do hope you guys can forgive me, but 16 has been such a wild ride. I love it. I loved it so, so much. Even though I was playing it on, on my colleague's um, system, at least I, I was able, we were able to play it all the way to the end. I need to get the game myself so I can just replay the whole story all over again. Pro maybe one day do it on stream. But yeah, it was such a wild ride. I really loved it. And also I never fit, I never changed my title. Oh, I really do that quick. I guess I was just so excited about this collab that I never- I just- I let everything else slip. So let's see, Final Fantasy. Fourteen. And sixteen. There we go, I fixed it. I have to make sure I, I fixed it on this one too. But yes. Um There we go, I fixed it guys. Is that the book thing? It's the we're doing the collab right here, right now. I'm 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 so I can't wait. I can't wait. I wanna get in this Oop, wrong one. I wanna get in this game and get started now. But yeah, as I was saying, um, Final Fantasy 16 was a wild ride. It was so fun. I love the music, the storyline, and everything. I haven't touched on the DLC just yet. I think my friend did it on the... Um, well, not... Well, yeah. No, friend, yeah. Friend, co and slash colleague, did it on their own, so... I decided to just be blind on the DLC. But, aside from that... Um, it was so, so fun. So, I really want to do this collab so badly, because I miss Clive, I miss him. I want to see him again. Oh, wait, let me change back to my gunbreaker. I always gotta start off with my base outfit. And also, I need to... I think it was character. There you go. Cause of fish by monk training. All right. Now the question is, where does the collapse start exactly? Oh, wait, let me look it up real quick. And also, hold on. I don't think I have a UI up. No! You didn't see anything. You didn't see anything. 
Oh, it's gonna be an Uldah. Oh, just like the, just like from the last, from the last, uh, from the last collab. Okay, so everything's happening in Udal, so we gotta go there now. Now, we're on there now. We gotta, we gotta go there right now, right now. Where is it? Faster! Faster! Teleport faster! I wanna start! I wanna start! I wanna see him! I wanna see him! Ah! Ah! Oh, there he is! There! Th this is where it starts! This is where it starts! Alright! Alright, here he is. A land of fire. A neophet. Neo. Neo. Yeah. Yeah, I think I said right. A neophyte adventurer seeks the warrior of light. Forgive my boldness, but are. But you are Karina Kawanami, are you not? Are you Karina Ka Making a. Uh... I should practice. I'm make... trying to make a, a certain voice for you. Are you creating a call now, I don't see it. <clears throat> I don't see it. Uh -oh. I don't see anybody else whose name create a call now, me. Yeah, you're looking at her. Nah, nah, that's too deep. Too calm. She's not, not that calm. And then my search has ended. A uh, big goggled gentleman tasked me to find you. You see, in hopes of entreating with entreating your aid with some matter he deigned not to share me. Pray remain here. I shall mention my once. Oh, okay. Greetings, champion. Hey, the wandering minstrel! Tis I who employed the young adventurer to facilitate this impromptu audience. As for why, I have a, a request to you. I request that you, and you alone, can fulfill. Pray listen well, for my tale begins with the most unsettling dream. In it did, I behold an evening sky boundless and shimmering, shimmering. As I drank deep of its beauty, I spy two stars sailing across the Indian expense. One of purest white, and the other blushing scarlet. Their courses set such that they might pass without confusion. Sharply and suddenly, the scarlet star shifted its trajectory. High above a burning landscape, did its path intersect with that of the white star, and their trajectory marked by a brilliant explosion of light. Even in slumber, I was awestruck by the smell. But what does it mean? What a lovely a lovely, t a lovely tale, a lovely tale, but I fail to see what this has to do with me. <clears throat> it's a little better. What does it mean? What would she say? Yeah, she probably say this. I get, I get the story, but how does that include me in this, in this mix? I do not wish to make any claims with certainty. Yet. Whatever greater meaning this vision may hold, I am convinced that the blazing white star represents the warrior of light. In other words, you huh? And should these these porches indeed foretell future events, you 
you are thus fated to encounter the Scarlet Star, whosoever they may be. I therefore humbly request that you, you accompany me to the burning land from my dream, that I might witness the visions of Duel. Duel. Duel meant. Deal. Mint, I think that's how you say it. I will. Oop. The question is, which territory in Aeosia might be considered burning, metaphorically or otherwise? Bowels of Ember, the Burning Wall, Eastern Denwin, a rich, corrupt crystal deposit. They can, be, they can look quite fiery! <laughs> More likely, the Bowels of em Embers. But yeah, crystals do explode. While its relations to flames cannot be denied, my instincts tell me no. See, see, uh, my dream was more like a rigid bowl, giant liquid outcrop of crystal, perhaps. Of course! Oh, so it was a crystal! So, a place rich in corrupt crystal deposit? They could look quite fiery. Crystal may have yet. Would have been a mid size akin to. to which comprises the burning wall. Aye, the site resembles a sweet sea from the dream. The first mystery is solved. We shall leave for Eastern Thetalin and the infamous burning wall at once. Oh, so it was the burning wall. They said something fiery, alright? They're both fiery, and, and crystals do explode. Crud crystals do explode like crazy. Oops, sorry. There it is. There. But I guess the burning wall will have will do. Camp dry bow, we go. Everybody's, everybody's doing this event. Look at that. Whee! Oh god, I can't see with all this rain. Ah! Good thing there's a map. Oh, it's up here. Alright, we're at the burning wall. Alright, are we almost there? Yeah. I can see I can see a group of people. Ugh, so much rain today. Burning wall, an apt named indeed. Tis said that the crystalline structures were formed when falling shards of Dalma pierced the land with ethic real current. Some see them as the symbol of rebirth, manifestation of renewed life. But that is neither human or man, nor the earth. Let's have a look around, shall we? Spy glasses at the bay. Alright. Surveying your surroundings for any. Oh, seeing anything out of the ordinary. Okay. You know what this means? It's time to go. Go sniper mode.
No, it's just rocks. Yeah, I don't see anything. Wait, what the? hard to see there's a guy on the ground and he looks like he's unconscious hey there's a guy guy unconscious down there come on hold up now this sounds familiar. Oh my god, it's the Chisel Dragon! <laughs> oh my gosh, it's... Holy shoot! Where am I? Holy shoot, Sal! Shoot, dang, Clive! You are really detailed compared to... Well, they're... Well, yeah, you are very detailed here. What, what's going on here? Here. We found you unconscious. Good. We, fa we found you unconscious. Led me to you. Oh, yeah, and that too. I understand how sir may sound. We ourselves are, were unsure of what awaited us here. As for who we are, I'm content to be. Oops! Dang it. Clive. I. The last thing I remembered was the ruins. Seeing you were not senseless. Confusion is to be expected. For safety's sake, I suggest we make the town and have a frontis fr street physician look over, look over, you. look you over. I shall see that the patient receives the proper treatment. Would you mind waiting for us at Scholar's Walk? Yeah. Oh my gosh. This theme music though. Ooh, I ah oh gosh, I missed it so much. Oh my gosh. I know it. I uh, it's been a while, but god I missed that theme so much. It was when we were at the camp when we we're like at the camps and stuff. Our our foundling is being cared out for as we speak, but I'm told he should be released soon. Hopefully, it was not that a bite of food and a little bed rest couldn't cure. Well, that's well, that's good. Hey, about that guy earlier. <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's right there. Oh, sorry. 
forget to close these when we're doing cutscenes. It was kind of you to wait. Thank you. What of your condition? Much improved. The physique seeker also noted no signs of, ma of in injuries or illness. God, he's hot. Yet my memories remain hazy. How did I end, end up here? Whatever I was doing, it was important. I'm sure of it. I must return as soon as possible. I see. We cannot leave him in the state. We must help him restore his memories and find his way home. What of the city, Clive? Do any parts of Uldal strike you as familiar? to think that the sights and sounds of a well-known lo locale will hasten your recovery. The burning wall, the place where we found you, you is situated midway between Udal and Gadania. Perhaps a trip to the Twelves is in order. Gadania, you say? The name rings no bell, but I have, have no better suggestions. Take me there. Leave, leave it to me. Meanwhile, I, sh I sh shall make my rounds in the neighboring settlement. Ask if any have heard of you. Let us rendezvous in Gordania anon. All right. Oh my god, he's r just right there. He is just right there. God. Oh my gosh. This entire situation has been not. Has been not. Who you know, was it? I appreciate you coming to my rescue. Ugh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm still so awestruck that this is, that this is happening. I re- I'm, I'm sorry, but God, I'm so happy. Still, you must have your business your own, your, uh, have, have your own business to attend to. We can set up whenever you're ready. All right. Now I, now I got plenty of time, dude. Let's do this. Pain to recall. I was ready to travel to Gridania. Are you ready? Then let's head out. This Gridania the minstrel mentioned. Is it far? Will I need, need mounts? Yeah, we get... Yeah, we got an airship. By airship. You have those? Not that I... I mean to doubt you, friend. If... If you say we're boarding an airship, then that's all we need. That's all we'll do. Yeah. I mean, we could do the per usual teleportation thing, but uh, I don't know. Would well, actually, that's a good question. Would he just um? Uh, does he know about teleportation crystals or something? Many questions. Oh, you know what? This reminds me of that one time when, um... Oh, this reminds me of that post that I saw earlier. When the collab just start, started... What, the collab was announced a few days ago. When, like, the Warrior of Light is just walk And Clive are just walking by. And there's this giant crystal over there. Clive was staring at it while... While the warrior... While the quote-unquote war, Warrior of Light is... Oops, sorry. 
while the Warrior of Light was, um, yeah, while the Warrior of Light was, um, explaining how the, the, how we use teleportation crystals, and then Clive was slowly grabbing onto his sword, and the Warrior was like, no, it's not, no, it's not what you think, it's not, it's not like that, it's just for teleportation! I promise you, it's not like that! Still grooming onto his sword, and that was like the funniest thing I've seen all, all day. Now, now the collab is here, so... But still, he probably... If we hadn't explained that it was a teleportation crystal, he would've most definitely knocked it over. <laughs> anyway... It was... It was a funny one. Karina, if I may ask a foolish question, do these airship of yours actually fly? Yeah! Foolish question indeed, then. Expression tells me as much. First time traveling by airship? Is there no airship where you're from? Well, I know what I said, but what would Karina say? Yeah, she'd probably start poking around around people's background. So <laughs> what? Is there is there no airship? Airship travel where you're from? So would so it would seem. It's odd. I know that the what weapon on my back is called a sword. I understand what it is for and how to wield it. Foggy as my memories may be, my general knowledge seems intact. Yet here you speak of functional airships. I felt confusion displayed for something that you clearly think is a commonplace. And I can make no sense of it. Where was I before now? This is pointless. Ford is the only way. Hmm. Okay, follow me. I'm gonna go get us some tickets and head to uh, Gordania. <laughs> oh, we're actually gonna cut the scene for this one too. Just him, or no, no, that's just us flying away in an airship. All right. Here, bud. Yeah, I get, yeah, I get that feeling a lot too. So this is Gridania. It seems very unlike the city we just, we just left. Where it's begin. I think it's best if I follow your lead. Oh my God! Yay! Oh my goodness! He said follow. Yeah, I get to, I get to walk around with Clive. Yay! Alright, follow me, good sir. Oh my goodness. Oh no, or. Well, yeah. Oh, thank you. Oh, wait, that was a quick. That was quick. That was well ended! This is a tavern. Why is it just sitting there? I've been before. I can feel the, feel the memory. It's like grass biggest at a smoke. But maybe if you were to show me somewhere else. Let me see if there's any like cool bubbles anymore. Nope. Oh no, we're getting close to that crystal. To the teleportation crystal. Alright, before we do that, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ooh, perfect. Right here. Hold on, wait. Uh... Yeah, actually perfect. Hold on, wait. Alright, I'm just gonna... Oh, wait. Hmm. 
Where's my change pose? What is it? Sorry, I gotta do something real quick before before we continue. Where is my thing? Dang it, where's my change pose? Ah. Try to find it. Oh, there it is. I see it. Oh, no, wait. This is perfect. Alright. Oh, wait, no. Oop. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Okay, now I can do the thing. Oop. Right enough where you can see Karina's face. There you go. All right, all right, now I'm ready. <laughs> I had to take a picture. I wanted to take a picture. All right, let's go. Oh yeah, so let me change the pose again. There you go. All right, all right, Clive. How about this place? A chocobo. Now that's something I recognize. Yeah, it's more than that. I had my own chicken bowl once. I'm sure of it. I, I know! I know, and I know her too! Not Karina, but I, but I know her! And I know her too! But as for winning in the where. Oh my god, you forgot about Ambrosia! She was your best friend! Surely? No, not nearly large enough. When I try to wrap around the fog in my head, almost seems to grow thick, thicker. Oh, oh yeah, this is where the this is where the comic started. Like they be like Clive and 
and the warrior like just be looking at this mother crystal. I explain how it works, but he slowly grabs his sword, and the, and the warrior's like, no, 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 it's for transportation, it's for transportation, don't do it, guys! Yeah, it's definitely not a mother crystal. This is, this is for, like, transportation uses only. You have nothing to worry about that. It should be all okay. And I, it seems like this is our last stop. Yep. Oh god, he's so he's so hot. Well, of course it is. It is my home. It is my home, after all. You've taken a liking to Gridania, then? Have you remember anything else? Have you remember anything else? Brief flashes of, of this and that, but nothing suggests I've been here before. I just can't shake the strangest. As if it's too peaceful, and that doesn't suit me. Patrol reporter, commander, it's all all is quiet with the excellent. No setting of Gar Garuda. For which we proudly, for which we are profoundly grateful. At ease, soldier. Oh, yeah. Hey, what the- uh, Clyde? You there. This guru do you speak of? Ugh. Sir, are you alright? Karina, do you know this gentleman? He's- He's new to this area, and he sort of kind of lost his memories. Memory loss, you say. Sorry to hear that. Though it seems that Gruda's name ha has lit a spark of sort. That was a battle with Gruda. I fought her. I'm sure of it. Please, you must tell me more. Anything that might help me remember my past. Of course, Nadia owes a debt of gratitude to Edo who stood against the destructive beam. However, there is there is one more su suited th suited to the task than I. Our elder seer is well versed in not only primal lore but also the treatment of bodily aff afflictions. She is surely your best hope of recovery. I will send a word ahead to the still glade fa fane. It's dead ready. To escort our guests to the uh, to the honor uh, to an audience. Understood, Commander. Pray find me at Nofika's altar in Old Gridania, and I will see that you are granted entry to the Lotus Stand. Thanks, man. Loss begins with Garuda. I can of that I can feel certain. The low stand lies just ahead. If you will follow me, me please. Okay, so this is the lotus stand, and it's where the sea the sea should be should be coming. Is where we hold all of our our meetings here. <clears throat> Greetings, honored guests. Hello, Kana -e. Hello, Kana -e.
Oh, dang, I know this theme too! Dang it! Oh my lord! Oh, I just love- I just love Final Fantasy 16's themes. Commander Heliox has appraised me of your friend's condition. This is he? Yep. A pleasure to meet you. I am Kana Asena, Elder Seer of Gridania. I thank you for your gracious welcome. I'm Clyde. Though beyond that, I fear my introduction to Clyde. Please consider yourself not with priorities. Tis your memory you lost. Oh, true. Put this off the frick control on, on the table. Yes. In an instant, I ah, dang it. In an instant, I heard, I heard it. A hazy vision of a bow rose unabided. I think perhaps if I could hear more of the reader. A wish easily granted. Garuda is a is a deity revealed by the Zalia. Zala. Zal. Zal. Yeah, Zal. A people who once dwelled here in Twelve Woods. She appeared as a winged entity, half bird, half woman. Her command, the wind itself, was frightening. However, it is her cop copper thus tempered as an unpredicted as the howling storm. I should add that Karina has fought against Garuda in her primal incar incarnation. Yeah, it... It was a... Yeah, it was a bit of a hot mess. Wing woman of vol a volated temperament, the power of the wind, the fitting description of the opponent. But a deity? No. The will behind the monstrosity of the Zaj is distinctly mortal. I suspect Clive's Garuda and Aeosius primals are not one of the same. Honoring Unstral! How'd you let yourself in? Mainly as Clive himself is not of our world. Explain yourself, Minstrel. I went back to where we discovered Clive and questioned folk in all nearby settlement. Not one person recognized his subscription. Such a distinctive tattoo escaping the notice of every local's rumber, rumber monger for moms around? Improbable. That led me to consider another possibility, one consistent with past accounts I've heard from of visitors from the other world somehow stumbling through reality's curtains and finding their way to our star. Does it pain you to I feel the memories trying to surface. But when I try, when I strain to recall, pussy wing rings my ears. The bearer. In Ifrit. Another primal's name. To see the pain has less than intangible source. 
Long have I studied the healing arts, yet I sense no shadow of illness in your body. Your suffering stems not from injury nor sickness. Victims of terrible events have been known to suppress their own memories out of instinct. One subconscious denies attempts to confront with an awful truth, mind creating a shield of paint a shield of pain to protect the heart. The bearer of my own making. How then then am I am I to overcome it? With our aid, of course. brought us together, and together we shall try over, triumph over this adversity. So, you think me from another world, and my memories of said world are not like to return unless I acknowledge some terrible truth, of truth my mind refuses to remember. T'was a confounding dilemma, I agree, and I have given thought to a solution. I believe that that the shackles which bind your mind may yet be struck off in a, in a heat of battle, a drastic measure perhaps, especially not when not at your best. Which is why I turn to you, Karina. You are, are the twin to Clive's wandering star. Your involvement is no accident. The path I, I see is thick with thorns. But if you the will to walk it, then gr grind, grind yourself for war, and wait for me at Ab 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 Blue's Fall. The Path of Inferno. Oh, now this looks like the finale. The Minstrel has a plan, it seems, but he shares a little beyond confusion with metaphors. Still, I'm willing to indulge him if it means making progress. We're to meet him at a pack of thoughts, right? Where, where is that to be found? Not far. Then let's get on with it. Yeah, it shouldn't be too far. We'll hop and skip. And skip away. Alright. Alright, our finale. I wonder, is this taking. Well, is that even possible? I know it's like. This is actually just like. Head cannon stuff, but is this taking place after like he he finished um, fighting off Garuda and they got knocked unconscious and all that good stuff? Was that was that where it's been left off? I know it's head K. This is that that part didn't happen, but oh, it's a vet too. Because this waterfall is where a legendary Archon Louis Wall gathered 
with a band of adventurers in the time of the seventh um umbral calamity. There I propose to extinguish the infernal infant. Ifrit! Uh, I know something is there. I just I get to remember. I've called several world words in the Elder Seer's presence. Words which brought me pain. S while the significance of bearer and leads me, you and I are more, more than familiar with the fruit. Considering mm -hmm. your reaction to the mere mention of so it's likely that the primal or equivalent to your world is deeply connected to your condition. Thus, I have resolved to weave my theoretical magics to bring you face to face with the Ifrit of all of them. Here, where the arch will we swallow paved the ethereal path to the Primal's lair. Will my word be given substance? And within the vision which takes form, will you do battle with a phantom of your own creation? Imagine though this confrontation may be, I fear your suffering will all all too, will be all too real. You must preserve, yet you must preserve. For your hidden truth will be on earth without hardship. Take heart, Scarlet Star. Call upon the strength of your shining twin. Pass the winds. Oh dang, I'm my level. My level, I'm gonna be knocked to a to 110. That's what you know it's about to get. You gotta get really serious for this. Okay. It's one thing if it's knocked to 50, but when your level item is down, that means. Oh, wait. It's about to get real. Where has he sent us? You stand, bef stand in the bowel of Ember. The site where I'm. Amal Malja sam summoned their patron deity, the stage upon which the warrior light became the slayer of gods. Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh yeah, I remember that. Oh. Twas but convincing illusion, the body of recounted tale given birth by fe it's a full verse. Come forth, Lord of Inferno. Oh, oh dear. I am super glad that I'm running this on 7 720. 60 FPS. Accurate. Percent. Smile. Yet not quite. Quite the Ifrit you know. No. Not quite the same. Oh, 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 now that's the free I recognize too. Holy shoot! Dang, bruh. Okay, now that's the free I recognize. Uh, or at least not Karina, but in Final Fantasy 16. Holy shoot! Dang, they. Those it. 
those animators went all out for for this part. Time to recover the truth. Ready when you are. Re ready when you are. Together, then. Ah! <laughs> Balvi! That's the thing which killed Joshua. Yes. I've been on its trail, seeking vengeance for my brother! Oh my goodness! Yeah, it is that part! Speed must pay. Fight with me, Karina! Yeah, it is that part after he's been through. Probably still must be for that other part. Or, or is it before? Uh, during this battle, you will gain access to special duty actions follow. Use Rising Fling to charge the foe and inflict high damage. With proper timing, you can dodge. You can use dodge to avoid taking damage, even, even if you're within the area of the enemy's attacks. Certain enemies' attacks can be seen by cooldown icons. When this countdown progresses the dodge icon, and quickly use the dodge icon. After executing a dodge, the dodge will change to precise strike, which provides opportunity to inflict additional damage. Oh, there. Rising flame. And then die. You know, it might be just better if Don was right here, Rising Flame. Let's do this! But at least I get it. Oh, uh, that's okay. I get it now. There you go.
Oh, I can't even do my, um, the other one. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, I got it. I thought it was too early. Flames are getting hotter. Oh, no. Oh no. Uh no, no, no! Ah! Not this again! <laughs> oh, you are not squishing me! I know! Still in the fight? Yeah. I'm, I'm good. Oh! Now what? Oh wait, the nails! Even with that much, it's not gonna do much. It's not doing any damage. Enough. Be more or none stick. Leave none standing. There you go.
Oh no, I didn't have it right. Oh wait, no, no, we got it. Oh god, he's me so much hell. Ow. So what, Karina? Let's finish this. Yeah. Oh, it's up. Saw that one coming. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, this prison is dodging. It's so fun. Ooh. Okay, there you go. Bounce right back up. Blame another to spare myself the guilt. I fear that by accepting it, I will lose what little of me for me. But I accept the truth of it now. You are. Not. I am. Oh, you are my. Oh. Well, I, I don't know what Tucker it has, but you know what? He probably got all his memories back. Holy shoot! Burrito's like, Naughty the actual fuck? Oh, snap! Happening in my fall, Fancy Pussy! Holy shoot! Yeah! Time fight! Wow! Oh, sucker punch that sucker! Oh dang, you must be tired. In the battle against your own mind, twas seem you have emerged the victor. Intriguing. Dog? There I go! <laughs> the best boy! The even best boy is here! Good boy! Just like that, we're back. The illusion is unraveled. Yet you've brought back a, f brought a friend back with you. Durgal! This is Torgal, a wolf pup raised in the duchy. There is no more wolf ally in battle. And no keener guy than the road ahead head is uncertain. Oh, can I pet the dog too? Please? Ah, uh, that explains the abbreviation of the link during ether. Torval is here to lead you back to your own world. Wait, you can do that, Torval? But then again, why am I questioning things? There's always been abnormal things happening. Clive has embraced his harrowing past. In doing so, reclaimed the mem the memories that he lost. Though not conscious act, he has manifested his readiness to return home from 
in the form of a trusted companion. Even so, it was difficult to accept what I've done. My younger brother, Joshua, was kind and gifted soul. The inheritor of the Phoenix Flame, he was destined to become the Archduke as our father had before him. But Joshua was murdered, his bright future cut short. Well, he is like at that time period after he fought Garuda. From that day onwards, I lived on for one purpose. A dominant of fire had slain my brother, and I would have my revenge. I spent years tracking the killer until one day, come to understand it had been me all along. Oh. I was young and distraught when I first summoned Ifrit. I had known such power lurk lurked within me, or it could even exist at all. Transformation was instinctive, uncontrolled, yet by my hand that Joshua died. I can but, but imagine the anguish that's caused you. There was anguish, yes, and a guilt I will never escape. But I cannot let it stop me. I was born of the vessel for Ifrit's power, and I need to know why. It was the search for answers that I went on Phoenix Gate and Del into the ruins below. Oh, it was oh, it was a little bit further, further after Garuda, after the Garuda fight. There was the courage to find a place to fi to face my past and accept the truth, and then everything faded black. Oh yeah, so it was definitely like the hand head cannon, head cannon version, or like the fan or like the collab version of it. Like, instead of, like, the other thing happening, it, it ended up wandering to our world. Hmm. You tell just something in the ruins. Something mysterious force was responsible of your ever journey. If you arrived in Aeosia from the place sacred to the phoenix and its flames, then it stands to reason. Yes. What are you thinking? I'm thinking that to see you home... Then we must return you to the beginning, where our road takes us back to the burning walls. Once you're there, the, your furry comrade will lead us exactly where you need to go. Come on. By the way, can I pet your dog? And Korea will probably say the same thing too. Hey, by the, I, this is random, but can I pet your dog real quick? Rick. Oh, dang, that's like a. You know, that's actually a nice inspiration. She'd be like, hey, I know that you got some heavy stuff going on here, That's uh, and that's alright. I, I, I understand how you feel, but. But real quick, can I just pet your dog real quick? You are such a good boy! You're even. You're, you're almost as big as. That's my husband's dog! No offense to him at all, but you're just so cute! But don't worry, aside from this story event, which I have- what- which I have thoroughly enjoyed, um, there's actually other things we could do to get some- to get some in-game items, which I will save, uh, which I will save, you know what, I might, if, if, or, actually, nah, I'm gonna drink some extra coffee when I get home tonight, I wanna play some more, I wanna see what this has, and to make up for a Splatoon too. so, it'll be a long midnight stream, we've come this far, now Torgo will be our guide, such was the purpose of this creation after all. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Important. Another important thing. Wait.
that wasn't it. There you go. Ooh, you good boy. Ooh, you good boy. Oh, you're just a good boy. Wait, one more time. Ooh, you good boy. Oh, my boy. Okay. All right. I'm sorry. Uh, so where are we? Ready, trouble? Take me home. Oh. Chose to depart, climb the water, which will come with you. Trouble will begin leading towards you. Fall trouble to its destination and try to fall behind. It's a good thing I'm level, level 9 or else these monsters would get on my nerves. I know this is level 50, but maybe they should have just said level 60 so like the monsters doesn't bother you or anything. Because I know if someone started out as 50 and did this quest, they, these guys would be all over. Oh, looks like that's our last stop. Alright. Right here? Alright. Ooh. There you go. I think this is it, Clive. Is this it, boy? Tail ends where it begins. Where you fa first found me. Indeed. I was baffled as to why, th why this of all places would serve as a jun junction between our two worlds. But now I think I understand. Some years ago, Eosia was visited by a cataclysmic disaster known as the Seventh Earthmore Calamity. And yet, even as the fire ruins threatens all who held dear, the world under with a mys mystical renewal. It was as if the star was before. One theory attributes a miracle to a benevolent entity, calm, claiming the undying Venus, Flare into to being blurred to being to save us our hour of direst need the phoenix the burning wall itself is, is the scar left behind those events the crystal ridge have erupted from the earth overnight some believe those monoliths of solidified flames to be proof of Phoenix's deliverance. The bond of which your bro brother, the Phoenix of your world, may have been connected, which brought you to this sacred place of ours. Drawn to the flame. <gasps> oh! I think it's I think it's your call. Seems our time together is at an end. Thank you both for all you've done. May your journey be fair. Press on, friend. No matter how daunting are the hardships, in the bitter truth. Pre press on, on, friend. No matter how daunting the hardships, or the bitter truth. Always, no matter what fate awaits at journey's end.
come, Torgo. We have answers to seek. And the Phyllis, Phyllis Thea awaits. story from the fleeting of ex That honor belongs to someone else, someone privileged to see his tale in conclusion. Sadly, the power to appear into other worlds has not granted me by this day's miracles. I wonder, however, if you might imagine here. Our little journey is over. There we go. Set mo motion at it was a dream, most cryptic. I must thank you for indulging my sudden and strange request. As for the promise of reward, I hope this suffice. Torgo proved to be such a trustworthy guy that I thought if I bind his likeness to the to a summoning whistle. Whoa! You can do that, Minstrel? May his loyal spirit spirit serve you, you well on your travels. Till we meet again. Thanks again, wandering Minstrel. There it is! Yeah, there's the... There's his attire right here. Uh, there, there's his attire right here. The Torgo Whistle and the Torgo Pop! You can exchange... Um... You can exchange MGP for special items by speaking to the Gold Saucer attended at the gold saucer. Yay! Found the flames! Alright, I gotta pop everything open. I got the attire. I got the... What? I got the whistle. Oh, let me turn this back on. And I got the minion. All right. And then... Where are we going next? Oh, yeah. We should go to the Golden Star to see some of the items yet. And then I'll close out for the day. And then I will close out for today. Oh, my gosh. That was so fun. I... Kudos to, all, to everyone who worked on this, um... Collab, especially the producer of Final Fantasy 16 for letting this happen. I'm sure the producer of Final Fantasy 14 had to do a lot of talking with that person, but in the end, they both worked together and they <laughs> made this happen. Those who know the joke, those who know the joke, know what I'm where I'm getting at. All right, I think it's I think it's the attendant. Yeah, this guy. No, it's the... Oh, wait, no, 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 not this guy. They say it's an attendant. They didn't specify which attendant this is. Is it this person? No. Yeah, they said an attendant. I don't know who. Who?
Oh, is it just talk to them? Gold saucer attendant. Yeah, they all say gold saucer attendant, but there's a bunch of gold saucer attendants. Yeah, there's a bunch of gold saucer attendants. Who am I talking to specifically? Oh, maybe I talked to this person. Go to this one, and then... Oh, here we go. So it was these. Okay, dang, that's a lot of money. I have a lot of guilds. Find the flame for to see away who I really am. Stay alone. Before the storm, forever. Yeah, this is gonna be a lot. I'm gonna be... Yeah, I'm gonna be farming a lot of orchestra. Uh, I have to farm a lot. Hopefully, they're not temporar temporarily or anything. Alright. Let me travel back to my house and we'll close out for today. So, two lavender beds. And while I'm at it, I'll bring out. I'll bring out the new mount. Just to see. Where it is? There it is. There he is. Who is your good boy? Who is your good boy? There you go. This is great. Et I'm sure he could fly too. But gosh, this is nice. This is this was fun. This was definitely a fun event. Or at least for me. I really liked it, Final Fantasy 16, so this was a definitely a treat. So anyway. Ooh, there you go. This is close enough, is any. Anyways. Thank you guys so so much for watching. I really I really do appreciate the visits. If you if you enjoy what I do and like what you see, please follow me on twitch.tv. Alright, tomorrow for real, we will jump right ahead to Splatoon 3. I will make sh I, I will for sure be doing that. And then the next day after that is going to be a... We're going to throw a small streaming party. I'll be streaming for 12 hours. I'll make that announcement tomorrow as well. Early, probably in the morning to, to tell you the details on, on what we're going to do for that part. For that streaming party because I have I know what to do I just need to write make sure write everything down make sure everything is all nice and planned out and then I'll send out the invitation to everybody because everybody's invited it's gonna be a lot it's gonna be a lot of fun we're gonna have a good time celebrating those hundred followers on tw on Twitter so so, tomorrow, Splatoon. Next day after that, party time. So, with that being said, thank you guys again for watching, and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye!